Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Kim and today I am at Kroger and I am working on my weekend warrior bonus, which I got um, $5 when I complete 15 offers. And then I got a candy cane bonus. Yay. I did not get that monster bonus. I was like, some people did, I think, and some people didn't, but I didn't get it. But I was excited to see that I got the candy cane bonus. And it is for $10 for 42 offers. So I was excited about that. So I'm going to try to complete my um, weekend bonus today. And the other, I'll just have to complete it maybe next week. But anyway, let's go in here and check out the deals. I'll be doing two transactions. I'll be working with Ibotta, Shopkick, Fetch, and Kroger Cashback. So if you are not a member of Ibotta or Fetch or Shopkicks, then my codes will all be listed down in the description box. You are welcome to join in. And then that way you can save money like I am. Work on one of the things I'm gonna to try to work on that I've not ever done before is like a huge shop kick like bundle thing. And I'm gonna bundle it with a big Kroger Cash um, back, like there's a coupon that's own Kroger Cash back that if you spend $25, like Cottonelle, Cottonelle wipes, Kleenex, things like that, then you get the $6 cash back Plus, it's like a Shopkick bundle too, so I'm gonna see if I can do that and work it together. There is a big, big mega event, so I'm excited. It's like $6, um, $6. It's six items and 50 cents off each item, but you have to buy six items, and I am going to film that in here too today. That'll be part of my series on how to shop at Kroger, so. Uh, let's go in here and see what we can do. First, I'm going to check out the little clearance aisle here at Kroger. I saw the other day they had some CoverGirl items, and they had this press powder. It's regular $6.79 at my store, and they had it on clearance for $2.35. I'm going to use this $2 coupon, and that's just going to make it $0.35. Cents. Okay, the Clorox Paper Towel Wipes. Now the wipes are, regular wipes are on sale too for $2.49 on the Mega Event. However, the Paper Towel Wipes, I'm going to grab two of those. And they're going to total $4.98. And I'm going to use the dollar off to Paper Coupon that came in the 10-3 smart source that's going to leave me to pay $3.98 at the store for both of these then i'm going to submit to shop kicks for 200 kicks which is 80 cents cash back and my final cost will be 318 for both or a dollar 59 each next the airwick starter kits they are on mega for 279 and i'm going to get pick up one of these i've got a dollar off one coupon that I printed from the Airwick. You can just go on there and print the coupon from the site. So I will pay $1.79 in the store, then submit to Ibotta for a dollar cash back. Final cost will be 79 cents. The Airwick scented oil refills are $4.49. Now, I'm going to use the $0.65 cent off one coupon that I got from my Airwick site. I will be paying $3.84. But Ibotta has a rebate for a dollar cash back. And then when you submit your receipt to fetch, you will get a dollar cash back as well. So your final cost on this will be $1.84. The Chobani Oat Milk. These are Omega for $2.99. I was excited to see this again. I'm going to pick up two of these for $5.98. And I'm going to use two of the dollar off one paper coupons. They were in our 10-3 Smart Source, I believe. 
But anyway, there's a digital coupon as well if you'd like to use just one paper coupon and one digital coupon. But anyway, you're going to pay $3.98 at the store and then submit to Ibotta for $3.99 back when you buy two. So your final cost will be totally free. And we use this in our smoothies. It is so good. We also needed eggs. And the Eggland's Best Eggs are the ones we normally buy anyway. They are not on sale. They're just $2.99. But you could use the 50 cents off one paper coupon and pay $2.49 in the store. Then Shop Kicks has an offer. You're going to get 38 cents back between Scan Kicks. Final cost will be $2.11. Next, the Dan and Light and Fig Yogurt. This is the four count package. These are $3.29 each. You can use the 75 cent off one printable coupon from coupons.com. But then you can submit to Ibotta for 10 cents back on any brand of yogurt. And your final cost will be $2.44. Okay, the Purdue Fresh Grown Chicken. They are on sale this week too for $6. So excited to see this. They only had two left in my store. But... I'm going to pick up two for $6, then submit to Ibotta for $2.50 cash back. Final cost will be $3.50 for both, or $1.75 each. Okay, Ken's Simply Vinaigrette Dressings. Those are $1.99 on Mega. Now you can pick up one and pay $1.99, then submit to Ibotta for $0.75 cents cash back. And your final cost to be a dollar twenty-four. Creamy Caesar dressing, and I'm gonna pay a dollar ninety-nine in the store. Submit to Ibotta for sixty-five cents cash back. Final cost to be a dollar thirty-four. Next, I'm just gonna grab this lettuce. It is on sale two for three dollars. And since we're gonna have some tacos, there is a ten cent any offer on lettuce. So I'm gonna grab that and. Put it in my cart. Okay, I had a free offer for bubbly bounce, but they didn't have any. So I'm gonna pick up this bubbling sparkling water and submit it to Ibotta for 75 cents cash back and my final cost will be 74 cents. The Thomas Everything English Muffins, then they weren't marked, but they are $2.99. And I'm excited to try these. I'm going to pay $2.99 at the store, but I'm going to get $1.25 cash back from my Ibotta, and my final cost will be $1.74. I posted these on my Instagram page, I think it was a couple of days ago, I can't remember, but I was excited to find these. And look, they have a cute recipe on the back for the Rice Krispie Treats, so I'm excited to be able to pick these up at $3.99. Then, submit to Ibotta for a dollar cash back. And if you have on your Kroger app, you can also get a dollar cash back. So the final cost for those will be a dollar ninety-nine. Okay, the next thing I'm gonna pick up is the Kodiak Protein Oats. These are $3.49 in my store. And I'm gonna submit to Ibotta for 50 cents cash back. My final cost will be $2.99. We haven't tried these, but we do like the Kodiak Pancakes. Next, I've picked these up before. I pick these up every time a rebate pops up. But the Chloe's Oat Milk is $3.99. You can submit to Ibotta for a dollar cash back and a dollar from Kroger cash back. And your final cost will be $1.99. And these are so good. A good, healthy treat. I've got a couple more offers to pick up. But I'm going to go ahead and start by bundle that I was talking about in the car. You spend $25 and get $6 back. And on Shopkicks, this is the bundle of the Cottonelle Kleenex Viva Paper Towels or the Cottonelle Flushable Wipes. And I think Scott's included. I'm going to pick one of those up and those are $7.99. Now I'm going to look for the Viva Paper Towels. And those are on sale for $8.99 in my store. So 
So I'm going to pick up a package of those. Now I've got about like $19. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up the Cottonelle wipes. And I'm going to go ahead and pick up this big package of four for $6.99. And that will bring my total to $25.76. We'll get $6 back from Kroger cash back. And from Fetch, we should get back 1,200 kicks plus 250 kicks for scanning the products in the store. Ritz chips are $1.99 when you buy two. Buy two for $3.98. Submit to Ibotta for $1.50 cash back and 75 cents. Kroger cash back on two. Final cost is $1.73 or 86 cents each. Next, the Cheez-Its are on sale for $1.49 on the Mega Event. Now, the Grooves are on sale for $3.19. So, I'm going to pick up one of each because I have a dollar off to printable coupon from Kellogg's Family Rewards. And I'm going to use it and pay $3.68 in the store, then submit the grooves to Ibotta for a dollar cash back, and my final cost to put $2.98 for both, or a dollar forty-nine each. Okay, what's an Ibotta haul without a Butterfinger? I'm gonna grab one of those for my last offer. Okay, my subtotal is $88.20, and I'm gonna scan my Kroger card, and we're gonna watch the coupons come off. Your total is $0.56. Okay, after I scanned all my other coupons, my subtotal is $43. Okay, my second transaction that I did, the, all the tissue paper and the, the little shop kick bundle all together, that total came down to $27. Subtotal $25.76, just like I figured. So let's go home and see how it all turned out. Okay guys, I am back home from Kroger. Everything went great. Um, I'm excited. Um, there was an offer that didn't go through, but I'll explain that in a minute. But let me just go ahead and go over my receipt. Wait a minute. Millie wants, Millie, you wanna go out? Millie wants to go outside just a minute. Let me let her out. Okay, there's the milk, and one rang up for $1.99 because I forgot I had an e-coupon on my card, so the other coupon didn't work, so I just took it away. And then there is the chicken, Purdue chicken, the lettuce, and the lettuce, by the way, um, the kind that I picked up here, um, this kind right here, it did not, would not attach, um, it wouldn't attach to the Ibotta rebate, the any lettuce. So, okay, there's the yogurt, the eggs, the Chloe's Pops, Nabisco crackers, Thomas muffins, um, the dressings, the Kodiak oats, the bubbly water, cheesy crackers, Butterfinger bar, of course. <laughs> um, then I see Cheez-Its, the Stuff Puffs, and then the Airwick Oils, the Clorox Wipes, and then all my coupons came off. And then it looks like, and then I paid my coupon savings, my Kroger savings, my total coupons. And so I did pay $48.82, and that is plus the tax. So I'll, I'll figure it without the tax in just a minute. But everything went great. Pretty good on that one. All the other coupons scan just fine. Um, I was excited to find that. I can't believe that those were on clearance. So look for your clearance in your stores. Um, that was 35 cents. And then the chicken, I was excited to even find an offer on those. We love this. We make tacos with these. I freeze one of them and we'll have one this weekend too to eat on when I make tacos. So pick up those. Those have been fun to do with kids too. And you don't have to really have to use Rice Krispie cereals. You know you can use like 
Frosted Flakes or Cheerios, too. So if you don't have any of those. But I love the Thomas. I have never tried the bagel. So I was excited to see that offer. And I was excited to see my store even had those. But that sounds really good with breakfast. We could make um, an egg, like an egg omelet like thing and put it on the muffins. And then the milk, I pick up this when it's on sale. We love that. And then the Ritz Toasted Crisp, those crackers right there. And then I picked up, of course, the oatmeal. We like to make um, those chocolate oatmeal cookies. Those are really good with those. And then I couldn't find the free offer on the bubbly, but so I did pick up, find the sparkling water, and this is in the grapefruit flavor. So I'll let you know how that turns out. There's the Butterfinger way down there. And then the Cheez-Its, I picked up one that was on sale. And then these were not on sale, but there was an I bought an offer on those. I have not ever tried the bold cheddar, but I know my boys will like those too. So I picked up both of those and those did work. Scanned on Ibotta okay. And um, the coupon went through fine, okay. Then the Clorox wipes, I picked up, now I picked up the ones that says paper towel wipes. Those are the ones that have the shop kick offer on those. So my subtotal before coupons was 88.20. After coupons, it was 43.57. Now I got back $2 from Kroger Cashback. I got back $1.12 from Fetch. And I got back $1.80 from Shop Kicks. I also got back $23.59 from Ibotta. I completed my weekend warrior bonus with my 15 offers. And then it says I finished a craft bonus. Um, I don't have a clue how I finished a craft bonus when I didn't buy anything craft. But I think one of my dressings hooked onto a craft dressing. So anyway... Um, I have 15 of 42 offers on my candy corn bonus. So all of this is a total cost of $15. And this is for 24 items. What a huge savings. And especially because I'm going to create different meals and breakfast things. And these are snacks for the weekend. I mean, that's pretty good. So it's 24 items for 62 cents each. Now let's go through the shop bundle offer. Okay, here is my little shop kick bundle that I did. I walked in the store with it on, so I got kicks for that. I also scanned all the items and got kicks for those and got the bundle kick back as well. So I was excited about that. Um, I did have to make sure I got $25 because the coupon in Kroger was spend $25, get $6 back. So I did do that. Here's my receipt where I bought all the items. And then without tax, it was like $25 and something. So I was right on the, uh, right over the $25 mark. So I did get my $6 back from Kroger, and when I submitted my receipt to Fetch, I got $1.50 back, and then Shop Kicks gave me $5.90 back, and that is equivalent to $14.75 between Scan Kicks and Regular Kicks. So pretty good for all those products. So it was $30 retail, and my subtotal was $25.76. And then after coupons and everything, my total ended up being $12.36 for all four items or $3.09 each. So if you add everything together, it'd be $27 out of pocket. And that's for $118 worth of products, which is an awesome deal. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope it gave you some ideas on some working on your bonuses, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new so you won't miss out on any deals. And y'all have a great weekend and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.